Please rise. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Happy Friday and happy homecoming. The unluckiest man in Frankfurt is back. I'm your host, Lathan. And I'm Alyssa. Before we start, here's a video from our College Connection coach, Ms. Scanlon. Good morning, hot dogs. I'm Ms. Scanlon, your College Connection coach. Now that you're all masters of financial aid, let's start talking at different colleges. To see what college we're highlighting this week, click on the link below. To see the full video and topic, click the link in the description. And stay tuned for the entirety of our broadcast for weather, sports, and news on DECA, yearbooks, and more homecoming events. Sending it now to our weather radar himself, Dallas. Hot dogs, it's game day. Let's go hot dogs. So, for the, for the weather, it will be a high of 81, a low of 51, and it will be partly cloudy outside. And for my inspirational quote of the day, for my final day on weather, it is, it's not who, I'm, who I am underneath, but what I do that defines me. Back to the studio with Alyssa. Thanks, Dallas. For lunch today, on lines 1 and 2, general style chicken. Line 3, soup and salad bar with broccoli soup. Line 4 is leftover chicken smackers and strips and assorted 4x6 pizza. And line five is closed. A happy birthday goes out to Twyla Kessler and Samuel Morales Saavedra. And a special happy birthday to our resident Frenchman, Mr. Spinchin. Sending it now to the caster of our sport, Emily. Last night, the, dog, the boys' soccer team hosted Danville in Sagamore Conference play. The dogs sadly fell to the Warriors last night. Rogelio Uncle scored before halftime. The dogs played a solid game. This was one of the best matches this season. The boys' JV also fell to the Warriors last night. The Frankfurt soccer program's post-conference opponent Tri West on Saturday at home. The girls' varsity game will kick off at 11. The boys' varsity will follow the girls with an approximate kickoff time at of 1. Saturday will be senior day for both the boys and girls soccer team. The boys' tennis team won against Crawfordsville and extended their winning streak to six games. The win was an exciting one, as Nolan Varner and Nick Kinder both won their single matches in dominating fashion, and with the match tied at 2-2, Number one double, doubles were able to pull off a tight three-set win. Jimmy and Noah did an excellent job working together and keeping a positive and competitive mindset as they kept chipping away one point at a time. Great job, team. Last night, the girls' varsity and JV volleyball team defeated Clinton Prairie. The JV began with a three-game match that ended in a solid three-game win, 15-7. Tara had six kills and two blocks. Jasmine Hernandez had 11 digs, and Sydney Whitaker had 12 digs. Morgan Adamson had six kills and Grace Campbell had two aces. Kylie Norman had served strong with five aces. For the varsity, the dogs came out strong and controlled the match. Blocking well for the team was Allison Timmons with three blocks and several touches. Chloe Rob Roberts had a big night with seven aces, two blocks and eight kills. Ashley Timmons contributed 11 digs and nine kills. Riley Iskrick had 28 assists and Avery Drew controlled, controlled the back row with 19 digs. Lindsay Gay had 11 digs and Emily Michael added 5 kills. Tammy Kingma con con continued her strong offensive presence with 6 kills and a block. Great job ladies, that's all for sports, now sending it to the field with Coach Byers. Good morning Frankfurt, today is homecoming. Kickoff's at 7 o'clock and we hope to see everybody out there uh, to support the team. If you don't have anything going on after school, from 2 to 5.30, we're going to be running a car smash where you can come out and smash up this lovely red van. For two dollars, you get a hit. For three or for five dollars, you can take three hits. We have sledgehammers out there, eye protection, anything that you need, and you can come hit that thing as hard as you want. Um, hope to see everybody out here at the car smash, and everybody at the game and the homecoming parade, and and cheering on our team. Thanks, Coach Byers. But there's a correction. We will be at the pep session at that time, so the car smash will start at 2.45. That's it for sports, now back to the studio with Alyssa. 
Thanks, Emily. DECA members, remember to turn in your DECA dues and central region payments to into Mrs. Bishop as soon as possible. Members are encouraged to use money bank from the Caseville fundraiser. If you purchased this 2017-2018 yearbook last year, the supplement pages from the end of the school year have arrived. You may pick them up at the bookstore beginning today. If you did not purchase the yearbook last year, you still can for $30. If you would like the end of the year supplement alone, it is $10. Today is the day. The homecoming parade starts at 5.30 with the game following at 7 o'clock. Make sure you wear your 19 Sports One Hot Dog Team t-shirt and bring your school ID to get into the game for free. There will, be also, there will also be the annual bonfire after the game. Only current FHS students are permitted. Come out for s'mores, music, and more fun. Well, that's all for the announcements. Be sure to like and subscribe and to keep up to date with, all, with our most recent broadcasts. See you guys again for one last time on Monday. Have a great Friday. See you later, everyone.